Hello everyone and welcome back to the ticket build. Uh, we are here at my building area and today we are going to build, build uh, the sheep shearer. Uh, sheep shearer is an automatic uh, sheep shearing machine. Mm, I have done some uh, preliminary work. I dug a a hole and covered it with uh, sandstone. This is for the uh, uh, bot switch, a uh, plug update detector switch. And here we have a cow, which don't have a, its wool on, but it will change. So I will build the uh, bot switch mm, offline because there are so many uh, manuals. Or tutorials in YouTube for it, so you uh, I won't show you that. I will link to the uh, uh, model I am building. So I'll be back. Okay, the uh, butt switch is uh, completed. Uh, if you don't know what a butt switch is, uh, quick demonstration. Uh, a butt switch detects uh, plug. Uh, updates uh, and, and in this model it's this piston that that does that so if I place a, a block next to the piston it will update it and send redstone to this output like so ah, I was standing on the block let's try that again I will remove it it's the same thing like so and I will use the butt switch to detect uh, grass growth on the uh, uh, dirt block. So the idea is that when uh, a sheep eats the grass on the grass block, it will update the block and this contraption will send signal to uh, a deployer and transposer which will shear the cow, uh, the sheep. So let's build the pin, uh, sorry, the pen for the uh, cow, uh, sheep, I don't know why I say all. So that that's the transposer. Mm, let's remove the sand underneath. And use different blocks like so and there's the uh, uh, deployer which will use the shears. Deployer uh, acts like an, uh, a player's right click so you, when you ac activate it it will right click what's in front of it and it will shear the cow. Uh, next let's place some grass blocks for the uh, cow to stand on, a uh, sheep to stand on, like so. Uh, grass blocks are quite uh, slow to uh, grow, so I will maximize it the uh, amount of the grass blocks that I can with this, at least with this uh, kind of setup. So the cow, uh, sheep will stand right here. And then we will we'll need uh, some walls for the uh, for the pen. So let's do this to keep the uh, light to come in and uh, the grass can grow. So like that. Uh, there, here's the sheep. Uh, now we can get it, him. That will cut the redstone. I need to remember to uh, remove that block. So let's get him. Mm, push him into the uh, pen. Yeah, nice good glitch. Hmm. Is it 
the glass blocks that are glitching. everything okay now see he's in so I can't place any blocks on, on top of this grass or it will die or maybe I can uh, if I remember correctly I can place glass on top of it and it will won't affect the grass growth but uh, let's keep it like that for at least now. Then I need to wire the, uh, uh, the deployer and the transposer. Uh, so let's get, get the redstone and the uh, repeaters out. Uh, this is the uh, output that will be activated. So let's go like this. And the deployer must go first. And then I'll let's go down. And I will delay the uh, transposer vortex, like so. And uh, then we need to uh, pipe the uh, the uh, wool, so the transposer is right there on top of that block. So let's go down so we can see it's this one. Ah, there's the blocks on. So they are crashed. Oh my god, that blow. That, that was a close one. So I will sl probably sleep. Okay, let's try that. Uh, the grass crew, so the uh, block updated, and I had uh, the, these two blocks on here, and it. it, it created an, a continuous loop. So let's get the piping done. Like so. And it, it, he ate the grass. So where's the, sh the wool? Oh, it was there. No, it was something else. <coughs> oh, I know. Uh, when you connect the uh, uh, tubing to the uh, transposer, it will keep the uh, stuff that it has gathered until we place an, uh, uh, a chest or something for it to put the uh, stuff in. So here comes the wall. Okay, great. So it works. Not that I had any doubt, but... Okay, let's put some blocks in here. Like so. And maybe like so, and a couple more. Then some stairs so we can open the chest. This seems to be working. I will place some blocks to fill this up. Okay. Mm. Uh, grass only grows with a uh, light level uh, 9 or more. Uh, oh sorry, uh, only spread. So let's place some torches to maximize the uh, so there, there it go again. Uh, I don't know if I got it, got it on camera, but let's hope so. And two more walls. But I will go and stare at the uh, sheep for a while. And uh, when we really get a clear... Uh, Real visual verification that it works, so then we can uh, end, end this episode. So I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so there it goes. Uh, the grass grows uh, 
faster than I expected, uh, faster than in my tests, but uh, uh, that's good, so it, this works faster than I thought. Now we can test if we place glass on top of the grass. If I remember correctly, this shouldn't affect the grass, grass, grass growth. Or, or kill the... Uh, Oh, there it grew. Uh, it doesn't kill the uh, grass that it it's is under the uh, the glass. So I will uh, watch this for a minute or two to see if this dies. If not, then this build is probably complete. Okay, so I'll see you in a minute. Okay, that that there there you can see that the uh, what happened to the wool crew and the uh, uh, shearer took the took the wheel wool away and the uh, transposer picked picked the wool up. Okay, so this works. Let's put, put a couple of glasses in here. Uh, we'll probably need to. Uh, give it some name, like we do with our, all our builds. Uh, what's a good name? Maybe just simple... Let's have some cake that I machine build. Um, I'd uh, have a lot of cake now. The sheep shearer. shearer. Okay, maybe I will put some uh, covering on the back so it doesn't th so that the dessert doesn't show. But uh, yeah, I think this is completed. So thanks for watching. Uh, uh, I will see you soon.